So, Dr. Hasenmeyer, thank you for joining us today at the Strategic Investment Summit USA. We're happy to have you. It's a pleasure to be here. Um, so I have a couple of questions for you regarding research and development at Bordering Ingelheim. Um, your company, BI, operates R&D centers in several different countries. And from your perspective, what are the advantages of innovating in the local markets? I would say, I wouldn't call it local markets in general. I think we have to in innovate in the regions and countries where there's the best access to science. So we're not having um, research in each and every country. and. That's why we consider U.S. and Europe very special countries in terms, in the, for the pharmaceutical industry, to have um, special access um, to scientific um, advances. Okay. And earlier today during the panel session, you mentioned that the pharmaceutical industry is sort of losing a little bit of momentum in Europe, and you're starting as a company to look into other markets. Well, if if I said losing momentum. Um, that's more on the commercial, on the access side. Okay. I would say you have very successful European pharma companies, mm -hmm. and I think we have very good um, research institute to work together with. Um, we have many new scientific leads. The big topic right now is what are the healthcare systems willing to pay for? And right now the regions that is the least willing to pay for innovation um, is to a large degree Europe. And that's why um, Europe, from a value as a, as a marketplace, and of course, there Europe has to be careful what will that mean for, from an investment perspective. Europe has lost in attractiveness, yes. And when it comes to innovation and, and furthering that goal, um, which, co or which countries are you looking to um, as you build the company? Well, clearly, the, the country with the most um, reputational um, um, research centers is the U.S. in, in one spot. Um, of course, U.S. is also not one country. I mean, there you have uh, um, basically the Boston area, you have um, um, the West Coast, um, very concentrated. In Europe, I would say there is still very good um, basic science in Germany, in U.K., in France. Um, so we are open. It's more in what field are we active? and where are the best research institutes that work on basic science that fits with our um, um, strategic focus. Okay. So, thank you for joining us here today, and it was great to meet you. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. Thanks for being able to contribute.